A school bus driver shortage in Columbia Public Schools is becoming an issue for some parents. The unexpected arrival and drop-off times are causing parents to miss work or their children getting to school late. ABC 17's Joshua Blount is here with me in studio tonight. And Joshua, those parents are saying CPS needs a solution to this transportation problem. The parents say they are they understand there's a school bus driver shortage, but they don't know how much longer they can keep up with these changes. Leanne Geis is a local mom who has children that attend Columbia Public Schools. She says she's able to adjust to the constant bus changes now, but she knows soon it won't be so easy. I know there's going to come a time where we're not going to have another option, and I worry about that because I don't know what I'm going to do if I have to leave my job in the middle of the day to pick up a child, especially with my younger kids who can't be left home alone. Schools alert parents if a bus will be late or plans not to show at all. Guy says she feels for single parents or those with demanding jobs. If you're a single parent, you're a you know, health care provider. What are you supposed to do? You know, if you're in surgery and your child's getting out of school, I mean, what are you supposed to do? Student Transportation of America Vice President of Operations, David Prince, says they are working hard to hire more drivers. But he says lawmakers could help getting more drivers hired and on the road. We have our drivers ready probably within three days after they pass their written test. But right now they have to wait 14 days. If we can get that drop, we can get more people into the system much faster. If you are interested in becoming a school bus driver, give STA a call. They say they are in need of people and the wages are more than $16 an hour to become a driver.